New Year. New beginnings. New hope. Today we are counting down on the top positive news stories of this new year. Here are the top three positive news stories of January, 2023. If you like the video and find the content meaningful, then kindly press the super thanks button and contribute whatever you can to the channel. Your contributions will help us create more engaging and informative positive videos. Number 3. Hero ran a marathon every day in 2022 and then went to work at his job, raising a million for charity. For many, running a marathon is an accolade of life, a culturally fixed way of proving athletic ability and determination, but for Gary McKee, it's literally just another day in the office. McKee ran a marathon every day of 2022 to raise money for cancer treatment, and a simple multiplication problem of 26.2 into 365 will reveal he ran 9,500 miles during the year, equivalent to crossing the United States three times. He ran through 20 pairs of running shoes, and what's more, his marathon was only a prelude to going to work in the morning at the Sellafield nuclear site. On New Year's Eve, he finished his final marathon to cheering crowds and fireworks near his Cumbrian home. News came in that he had made his £1 million mark for donations to Macmillan Cancer Support and West Cumbria Hospice at home. It's difficult to put into words how grateful we are to Gary for taking on this unbelievable challenge, said Haley McKay, Director of Funding and Communications for Hospice at Home West Cumbria. The physical and mental strength he has shown is incomprehensible. Number 2. British company develops first tractor in the world to be completely powered by cow dung. New Holland's brand new tractor runs on liquefied methane, allowing farmers to decrease their emissions and save money on expensive diesel. But that isn't the only reason it's more efficient, as the company says the fuel can easily be produced by methane from cow pies, allowing for a more circular economic model in the most circular of industries. The pioneering tractor is claimed to be a match for the performance of standard diesel-powered versions. The groundbreaking machine was developed by British company Benemann, which has been researching and developing biomethane production for over a decade. Waste byproducts from a herd as small as 100 cows are turned into a fuel called fugitive methane in a biomethane storage unit based on the farm. A cryogenic tank fitted on the tractor keeps the methane in liquid form at minus 162 degrees centigrade, giving the vehicle as much power as a diesel but with significant emission savings. It was put through its paces during a pilot run on a farm in Cornwall, where carbon dioxide emissions were slashed from 2,500 metric tons to 500 metric tons in just a year. The company is also investigating the wider uses of the technology and hope it could one day be used to charge electric vehicles in rural locations. Number 1. Tanzania scraps independence celebration and diverts funds to kids. Tanzania's president Samia Suluhu Hassan has cancelled Independence Day celebrations and directed that the budget instead be used to build dormitories for children with special needs. The 61st Independence Day event was to cost $445,000, money that will now be used to build eight dormitories in primary schools around the country. Tanzania's Minister of State, George Sambachoin, said that the money had been disbursed and the dormitories will be built starting January 2023. He said that instead of having parades and other national celebrations, the East African country will commemorate Independence Day by having public dialogues on development. Usually, Independence Day celebrations are marked with pomp and state banquets. This is not, however, the first time Tanzania has cancelled the celebrations. In 2015, then-President John Magufuli cancelled celebrations and diverted funds towards the building of a road in the commercial capital, Dar es Salaam. If you like the video and find the content meaningful, then kindly press the super thanks button and contribute whatever you can to the channel. Your contributions will help us create more engaging and informative positive videos.